Hello, have you ever wondered if there are ways to plan your family without using hormonal contraceptives or invasive procedures? The answer is resounding yes. Welcome to the world of natural methods of family planning, where you take control, listening to your body, and understanding the signal it is sent. So what is family planning? It is a procedure in which a couple plan for when they want to have children using various birth control and other techniques. Today we are going to focus only on natural family planning method. One of its examples is safe period or calendar method. Before that you need to understand the basic for the menstruation cycles. Um, we are talking about for the regular cycle of 1 to 28 days, 14 days of ovulation and 1 to 5 days of menstruation. So this method this safe period method was described by a scientist called Ogini and its calculation depends on the menstruation cycles. So this is the formula for calculation the safe period. This formula it is very important so you have to understand it very well otherwise you will end up getting pregnant. Formula is fertile is equal to shortest cycle minus 18 to longest cycle minus 10. The meaning is, what was the shortest cycle you ever had, like the shortest cycle you ever had before, and the longest cycle you ever had, that is what it means. So I start giving an example with a source that has regular cycle, cycle of 28 days. So we are just going to substitute our values. Shortest cycle is 28 days minus 18. To Longest cycle, 28 days minus what? 10. It is in the formula. So 28 minus 18, that is 10. To 28 minus 10, that is 18. From day 10 to 18, it is fertile. It is unsafe to have intercourse during this period. If you do, you will end up getting pregnant. But remember, this is the cycle of 28 days, day 1 to 28. This is the protein is for ovulation, but uh, what do you call it? First five days it's for menstruation. Then you cannot have intercourse during menstruation. So after the six, seven, eight, nine, you can have, which is safe. After the ten to the eighteen, you cannot have. It is fertile. It is unsafe. But after 18 days, you can have till next cycle. And this is an example for those that have irregular cycle. Those that have maybe she will have 25 days, or she will have 35 days, or she will have 30 days or 32. It depends. Or 20. It depends. So in that case, what you will do, you will think about what was your shortest cycle you ever had. Till now you have you have so many cycles so what was your shortest cycle if you think about that for example you, you, the shortest cycle you ever had is 25 then you write 25 minus 18 you write 25 minus 18 to longest cycle you think about the longest cycle you ever so you will think about the longest cycle you ever had that means the, since the time you started your administration Till death, you think about the longest cycle you ever had. Is it 30? Is it 35? Is this? Is it uh, uh, 32, 33? Whatever you think, then you write it here as your longest cycle. For example, let's see 35. 35 minus 10, 10 is in the formula. 35 minus 10, that is 25. And you think about the shortest cycle you ever had. That means, for example, let's say the shortest cycle you ever had. Since when you started your menstruation is 25, 25 minus 18, that is 7. So from the 7 to the 25, it is what? It is fertile, it is concept. You cannot have intercourse during this, 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 what do you call it? This, this. If you do, you will end up getting pregnant. So, all this method, but um, it is not 100% reliable and um, uh, the failure rate is kind of high so 
just for educational purpose and for those that they don't want to use barrier method or they don't want to use any pills and all thank you for watching guys